and he's uh, he's wired because he's plugged in with a microphone. You, you don't carry a big mic cable with him. It's Mechasaur. So. So where Mechanoid was a very deep, oh, he burps and laughs. So where Mechanoid is a very deep interaction as far as vocal and like the app, we wanted to create a highly interactive patch. So it's basically three feet long. Here's, we'll get him walking here and you'll just see the movement of his head and his tail. And because 10 year old boys like farting, he farts every now and then. He laughs at himself too. He has a sensor on the top. So his mood, you can tell by his eyes. Right now he's happy. They can go you know, orange and red. With the sensor, you can actually pet him. He'll purr, he'll shake a little bit. So I imagine that's what Tyrannosaurus Rex did. Um, the sensor's also for room guard. So if you, if you put him in room guard mode, and he senses light change or noise change, he'll charge uh, at, at that light. So he, he's trying to scare away a, a sibling, if you will. Uh, he also has yes, no functionality. Uh, so if you ask him a question, he'll be like yes or no. And again, you can program any sequence of, of forward, left, right you want into it. So um, what we found with this, well, these guys, is it's kind of a two-part toy. The first part is the build. You know, and we're finding a lot of co-play. It, it isn't one of those, you know, shut up and play type of toys. Yeah. We're finding, you know, moms, dads helping to, to play, but in a positive way. It, it's, you know, and, and our social feed's kind of littered with that sort of feedback. And that's what this guy's gonna be. Uh, I would say four motivated hours will get it built. Uh, and I say motivated hours, I mean that's you know a 38 year old who kind of knows what he's doing. Um, but that's part of the fun. So yeah, first part is building, and then like wow, like you have this huge thing that you built, and then you get to play with them as a pet or as a dinosaur. Uh, so that's that guy. Uh, and then 